I'm NASA Kennedy's Lee J. Lockhart, and I'm outside KSC taking you inside KSC. With 2020 more than halfway through, the workforce at Kennedy Space Center is gearing up for a busy rest of the year in 2021. NASA's SpaceX Crew-1 mission is targeted to launch from Kennedy to the International Space Station this fall, following certification of the system by the Commercial Crew Program. Boeing also is on deck to conduct a second uncrewed flight test, scheduled for late this year before a crewed flight test. Hardware is arriving for the first uncrewed flight test of NASA's Space Launch System and the Orion spacecraft. Artemis 1 will be an integrated test of the rocket and Orion prior to returning human spaceflight to the moon. The Launch Services Program, led by Kennedy, will manage the launch of the Sentinel-6 Michael Freilich satellite scheduled for November from Vandenberg Air Force Station in California. Earlier this week, technicians donned protective equipment to perform lab work on hardware for NASA's Orbital Syngas Commodity Augmentation Reactor, or OSCAR at the Neil Armstrong Operations and Checkout Building for a future mission. OSCAR is an early career initiative project at the spaceport that studies technology to convert trash and human waste into useful gases such as methane, hydrogen, and carbon dioxide. OSCAR is one of more than 100 mission essential and mission critical projects approved for on-site work. The Exploration Research and Technology Programs is performing for the agency. And this work supports everything from astronauts on the International Space Station to NASA's Artemis program. For more Inside KSC, check us out on social media or at nasa.gov forward slash Kennedy.